OTAN, Outreach and Technical Assistance Network. COVID, unfortunately, was difficult for a lot of people, but it really offered me the opportunity to really restart my career. I went to college in Santa Barbara. I got a computer science degree where I studied programming languages, operating systems, computer security, a number of different topics, and I worked for a startup. Then I moved on from there to Los Angeles, back to my my family's home, and uh, as an unemployed person, I had a grant to go for certifications. The scenario I was trying to navigate is, what am I interested in? How can I use all the skills that I've acquired? I never actually took a networking class in college. And so my background in math and computer science, I understood the concepts once they were explained to me, but I never had a formal education in networking. The adult school in Venice has a very unique opportunity. They have a Cisco networking academy, and the instructor is very skilled in uh, CCNA, which is Cisco Certified Network Associate. So he took some of our courses here in 2019, which included uh, networking, cyber ops, and security plus courses with one of our, our excellent teachers, Mr. Robert Jorgensen. It's very flexible with somebody who is either unemployed or working and wants to go to night school. And they have plenty of hardware that you're able to work with. Through EDD, uh, there's an opportunity to apply for scholarship grants and they will help pay for uh, training and certifications. It's very difficult for someone in my position to pay for an exam that costs $300 and you may miss it by one question and week after week, retake and repay for that uh, structure. In 2019, 2020, he took the Silver at SkillsUSA, which is a huge competition that not only is not only regionally, but it's supposed to, to state and then to national to select the best, the best competitors and the most knowledgeable, knowledgeable students. So the field that I competed in was the inter-networking category. This one specifically was focused on uh, customer service, technical support, and networking ap aptitude. After competing for three or four days straight, you know, 8 a.m. to 4 p.m., I was able to place in second place. And it was a really great experience. It was very rewarding and it really validated the effort I put in. And now we went back this, this last year and he took the gold in national. So that was a big celebration for our school. And um, uh, showcase, we showcased them all over the place, his trophies and his medals. After taking the, the competition, I feel very confident that it, I can pass these exams and with enough study and enough practice, anything is possible. I really noticed um, Nick um, just just being a great mentor to others and and really sharing without even uh, and building foundations for other people to empower them to thrive in school. My end goal is to to push for as many of these certifications that I'm enrolled in as possible, complete these exams, and in, in the next five years, try to put myself in a position to essentially be a, a CISO uh, Chief Information Security Officer. I just know he's going to make history in, um, in all his future endeavors and he's going to be a, an asset to all the companies he works for. It's my goal to both participate with my company and participate in the community with giving my best advice over all the experiences that I have and anything I can do to help support the community and, and progress our own security supports us all.